When the camera comes on, I'm on cue. My makeup so beat, I'm on too. She slays every time on cue. Hi, everybody. This is Christina Price with On Cue Makeup. Thank you for tuning in today. Today's look, and we're going to use a bold eyeshadow, like a spring summer color, which is yellow I use. And I'm going to show you how you can actually still use those colors in the fall and the winter time and still make it a fall, wintry look. So um, definitely tune in. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already subscribed. And make sure you like. Any comments or questions, please leave below in the comment box. Thank you so much. And don't forget to let the star on you shine. Okay, now since my brows and everything is done, and of course in my first video I showed you how to do that, um, I'm going to use an eyeshadow primer. The eyeshadow primer I'm using is Painterly by MAC. Once I apply it evenly, I'm going to blend out my edges, and I'm only applying it over my lid and just a little bit into my crease. Make sure that you blend it very well on the edges because it will show you your eyeshadow application. I love this primer because it adheres well to my eye as well as my eyeshadow. Now I'm going to use my 224 brush and use that to apply my blunt blush that I use as a contour. I'm going to use that as my buffer color in the crease of my eye to blend the edges of the eyeshadow primer. I'm using a fluffy brush like this one because I want to lightly blend it in the crease of my eye and I want a light application. The fluffier the brush, the lighter the application. The stiffer the brush, the heavier the application. Now I'm going to add my yellow eyeshadow. The yellow that I'm using is going to be chrome yellow from MAC. I'm going to apply this all over my lid. I'm using my brush here. It is a natural animal hair brush. I'm going to use a dark brown. I'm going to use it from the MARF 35W palette, I believe. And this is the brown that I'm going to use. This is also the same brown that I use to do my eyebrows. Now I'm going to take my 224 brush again and use my buffer color to blend this out. Now I'm going to use a frosty yellowish color here. This is Nylon by MAC. Using Mars G27 brush and I'm going to lightly put this color in my tear duct just to kind of open my eyes a little bit more, give me more of an open look. Now I'm going to go in with my liquid liner. Remember short strokes, hold your breath.
Okay, since my whole face is pretty much matte, I use matte eyeshadows. Um, my highlighting contour and everything is matte. My blush is matte. Also, the lips that I'm going to be using are matte as well. So what I'm going to do is to bring a nice contrast to that and kind of break it up a little bit. I'm going to use um, NYX Illuminator, which is a highlighter, and I actually, it's so white, I know it looks really white, but I tried it, it gives off like a gold shimmer, and it's really well with every skin tone pretty much. I've used it on the lightest skin tone to the darkest skin tone. So what I'm going to do is now go into my highlight and just, just a little bit on it. 